Good morning guys and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be filming a what I eat in a day and I have some new recipes that I really want to share with you guys. I like to eat meals that are healthy and really whole natural foods and also something that's very satisfying so that I will not be hungry and that I I just feel really full until my next meal. So I already had my hot lemon water and this is something that I have every single morning. I see it as a kind of like detox drink and I feel like it's an internal like soap for my system. I really love how it makes me feel. It's also really great for the skin. My skin always looks really plump and like super like fresh and young if you can say that whenever I had my lemon water and right now it's around 11 30 and usually I have my breakfast a little bit later in the day like I don't like to eat breakfast early I always like to wait until like 11 or 12 even I have also been experimenting a lot with intermittent fasting over the last couple of years and in my last video I shared my um, 18 6 fasting routine but ever since I uploaded that I just figured out that it wasn't really working for me at the moment and that's not to say that it didn't have amazing benefits on my body but with what I'm doing right now and my lifestyle right now it just it wasn't enough food for me and I couldn't really like fit that routine into the life that I'm living right now. So right now I try to just eat my breakfast a little bit later so as I said around 11 or 12 and then I will try to eat my like my last meal, my dinner in like not too late in the evening. So right now I'm just trying to do like the best that I can fasting wise. I'm about to have my first meal, my breakfast. And what I always do before my breakfast is to take my probiotic and prebiotic supplement. And this one is from Seed. It's my favorite, favorite one. And with Seed, it's so great because it's a double capsule. So it's ensured that this bacteria will make it down to where it needs to to be. It's super effective and I really saw a huge difference from when I started taking them. I will have them linked down below in the description box if you want to try them out. It's one of the best things that I've ever done for my health, for my skin, for my gut, which is the things that I had the most problems with when it comes to my health. And my gut is something that I've been trying to heal for a long time because I had a lot of gut inflammation and like anxiety and depression and that all came from how like which state my gut was in luckily now i'm in a much better place but i've also done a lot of things to improve my health so i take two of these on an empty stomach every single morning after i had my lemon water and before my breakfast i like to take them around half an hour before my breakfast so i'm gonna take these now and then we're gonna head on to breakfast So it is now a little bit later and I'm going to be making some lunch. Today I'm making an omelette and this one have uh, spinach in it. I have like a small bowl of spinach here, one red onion, and then I'm going to be using two to three eggs. I'm not sure how many yet. Um, some curry powder, some coconut oil to fry in, and then I'm just going to cut up this cucumber on the side just for some like extra crunch and a little bit of freshness because the omelette is quite like satisfying a little bit heavy so i wanted something fresh on the side so let me show you guys how i make it
Hey guys, it's now a little bit later. I've gotten home from work. That's why I looked a little bit more glammed up than in the morning. But um, I'm gonna be making some dinner now. And some of you guys may have seen this recipe before. It is a lentil pasta with lots of veggies and I'll put some cauliflower next to it. I don't have avocado, which I usually have. I have one here, but I'm pretty sure it's really bad. So I'm not gonna use that one. But let me just show you guys my little setup and my like the ingredients that I use for this recipe. So this is my little cooking station. I made everything ready. You guys should feel honored that I put it into all of these balls because it's twice the amount of dishes for me, but also twice the pleasure for you. All for you guys. Here I have cut up one onion and then four cloves of garlic. Then I've got a couple of portobello mushrooms, some asparagus and some zucchini. And over here, I'm gonna be steaming some cauliflower, which I'm just gonna have on the side. And in here, I'm gonna be boiling some red lentil pasta. That's my favorite, like, um, like healthy pasta. So that's gonna go in here. And over here, I'm gonna be frying all of the veggies that I just showed you. So here I have three tablespoons of coconut oil. And that might seem like a lot to some people, but I really, really love lots of good fats in my meals and especially coconut oil. It's so satisfying and so like, it tastes so good with veggies when you fry it. And coconut oil is also the only oil that doesn't get damaged and therefore like gets unhealthy for you when you heat it up this high. So I love coconut oil in my, like when I'm frying or whenever I'm doing something on the pan basically. So without further ado, let's get started on the dinner. <laughs> I'm having a little late night snack. These are some healthy uh, cookie dough balls, like snack balls that I made. Um, I will have the recipe linked down below. I'm pretty sure I made a video on these. Um, they are so, so good. And they're such a great alternative to like, if you want to eat healthy, but you love chocolate or sweets, then they're really satisfying. They have a lot of healthy ingredients like coconut oil and cashews and almond butter and all sorts of good things. So really recommend these. They are so yummy. Mm. Mm. So that was everything that I ate today. I hope you enjoyed this video and that you found some inspiration for if you're trying to eat healthy and you find it a little bit overwhelming or you're just looking for some new and healthy recipes. I really, really hope that this was um, helpful to you guys. And I love you guys so, so much. I really appreciate all the support here on my channel. It means a lot to me. And I will see you in my next video.